We have seen how nanotubes produced by arc discharge are deposited on the cathode, but nanotubes produced by CVD or chemical vapour deposition can be obtained on a base. In this video we use electron microscopy to show how different those samples are at high magnification. But first let's look at them with the naked eye. Nicole is holding two samples, one produced by arc discharge and another one produced by CVD. Remember we said that arc discharge doesn't produce great quantities, so guess which one is which? Let's go to Oxford and use their scanning electron microscope, or SEM, to have a closer look at the samples. First we need to put our sample in the holder for the SEM, and then Nicole puts the holder into the microscope. We can see the sample using a camera, which is inside the microscope. We need to set up the SEM, but with someone as experienced as Nicole this doesn't take long. This is the CVD sample at a lower magnification, but let's go to the highest possible magnification of the SEM. Now we can see the individual tubes. Let's change the sample and look at the arc discharge tubes. At low magnification we can see already that with arc discharge we have produced other forms as well as nanotubes. But let's zoom in to find individual tubes. Let's go now to an even higher resolution microscope, the Transmission Electron Microscope, or TEM. The resolution is higher and also the microscope is bigger, it takes almost a whole room. Nicole puts our samples in an appropriate holder and introduces it into the microscope. Again we need to set up the microscope before we take our images. These two images are an example from each sample. There you see how the arc discharge tubes are much more straight, more perfect, while the CVD tubes are more wavy because they have many more defects in their walls. I hope it's clear to see that the different production techniques produce samples of very different qualities with different structured nanotubes. Nicole gave me a great example. Nanotubes look like spaghetti. When they are produced by arc discharge, they looked uncooked. When they are produced by CVD, they look cooked. Thank you.